Um, hi. Hello. <laughs> my name is Kat. Uh, this is my friend Adim, and welcome to the first uh, episode of Us Painting. This is called Close Enough, mm -hmm. because these self-portraits are just gonna kind of look close enough for you to tell it's me and it's him. Yep, that's it. So okay. is this a date or? Uh, definitely not a date. Uh -huh. um, because I wouldn't, I, usually... I wouldn't pick you like to actually yeah. go out with. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I know you've Wait, asked why me. Why not though? Uh, looks, personality. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. Those are the two, two biggest things I look for in a woman. See, the biggest thing I looked for in a man that like disqualified you mm -hmm. when we initially met is that your mustache and your beard didn't connect. And yeah. You told me that I purposely was... actually grew this up because you. <laughs> no, literally, I think it, okay, I. I have such like a, a love for men who can yeah. grow like good beards, and uh -huh. you can grow a great beard. But when you and I first started hanging out, you always had your beard, but it didn't connect, and I didn't understand why you wouldn't connect it because you can connect it. Because I can, yeah. Because some people they they can well, how does grow, it look like, now? It looks great now. Before, like if you have a mustache and a beard that doesn't connect, I feel like it's fucked up feng shui on your face. Mm -hmm. It just like it's off. Shave it off. What does feng shui before. mean? Feng shui uh, means shut the fuck up. Mm. Mm. So um, what are you painting? We are going to be painting each other. So I'm going to paint you nice. and you're going to paint me. Uh, and Have you heard that thing where it's like an insult where someone says like, what? you look easy to draw? You know what? I didn't say that about you, know you but I feel like you'd be pretty easy to draw. I There's not much to work with. I'm going to draw you from memory at this point. Okay, very important question. What color are you using for my skin? I think we'll probably do the same. The same? There's, there's I two. I don't think we're you're the already same on the color. one up. Uh huh. Here we I are. don't think you might be darker than me. Give me a hand. You're darker <gasps> than me. That's the jungle Asian in me. Okay. Mm -hmm. So are you gonna choose a darker color? I might. Okay. I'm gonna start with black are just to get the outline. Are you gonna be offended if I make your face too big? No. Do you want to do full body or we're just doing faces? Uh, you do whatever you want to do. I okay. think I'm going to concentrate on your face, which is my least favorite part of your body. Oh, what is your favorite part of my body? Because um, we were talking about penis size. And you know what? I've heard it's about your ex. Probably uh, your backside because I just love when you get the fuck out of my face. Mm. If I'm being completely honest. Um, that's my favorite part. You invited me to this, so. I can't miss you if you're here. You <laughs> that's know? true. That's how uh, I generally You do feel. have a very like square face. So I, I feel do. like, yeah. My nickname uh, online is Rollerblox. Oh, that's yeah. kind of cute. It's because Asians made Rollerblox or? Did we? I don't know. I thought they were being like kind of racist. Oh, no. I think they were just trying to make fun of my square face. But like, to be fair. Look at me really quick. Okay. Should I stop? No, no yeah. Okay. Okay. So, oh, question. What does your chin look like? I can never tell what a man's chin looks like if he has a beard. Well, that's why I have the beard because... Do I have you a... have a fucked up chin? No, I don't have a fucked up chin. I just have a double Be chin. Be honest. If you do have a fucked up chin, I wouldn't judge you any more than I already judge you. Yeah. Now. No, I, I just have a double chin. So I was like, let me yeah. lose weight and then I'm not going to shave until I mm -hmm. get rid of the double chin. And you've just had a beard your entire life because you've since, never lost that weight. Since, <laughs> since I was a kid. No, uh, I actually saw a video of me recently. Yeah. And I was like, oh, shit, like, I look good without a beard. Like, I have a jawline and everything. Mm -hmm. But I just gained, like, 50 pounds since I had that jawline. Yeah. Oh, I'm already fucking up. Are you? Are yeah. you fucking? I'm starting with the hair, but oh, it kind of looks like just, a, like, a butt cheek and someone's about to shit. Yeah. Sick. Slay. Oh, fuck. Dude. This is so hard. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing, but you know what? I think it's going to turn out great. I'm just going to guess on what your chin looks like. Cause I don't know whether to make the self portrait of you right now or what I imagine you look like without your beard. Cause I think that's the real mystery. No, put the beard. Put the beard? Okay, yeah. Fine. I purposely have a beard. Like this is my look. Mm -hmm. No hair on the head and then. Yeah. I think that's a great look. I feel like a lot of people make fun of men who don't have hair, like men who are bald up top. And I think that men who are bald are some of the hottest men in the world if they just had other factors to like um, accentuate their baldness. So if you're bald, I feel like you're really hot if you're bald and jacked. I also, so if you me. have like a great beard and you're bald, yeah. that that's really hot. So not you. So not me, okay. Not you, yeah. But I can get there. I don't, I don't think you can. It seems like you've been trying to get there for no, a while. No, I've been, I've been doing good. And you got lost. Uh-huh. And you were never to be found. Like, we put your photo on a milk carton, 
like, hey, he's missing. Help us find Nadine. Bring him home. And you just were never found. That's uh, it's not a nice thing to say to people. Yeah, well, I'm not a nice person. To how's you. how's my drawing coming out? Um, it's it's coming. It's coming along, and I I think I have like a good base right now. Uh, it's a how far are you into it? I have literally just shaded your face shape. Okay. That's it. Um, I'm gonna work on your hair now. What about you? Can how you guys see you? what we're doing or no? <laughs> okay. Is it good? No. It's okay. It's gonna come together, but it just looks really bad right now. I, no, I came into this I with so much confidence. Asian? Oh my god! Oh, it's blood. Oh, that, that. You might look Asian by the end of it. That's fine. I am considered Asian, so. Yeah. Okay. So for those of you who don't know, Nadim is it's very sexy. Yes, thank you. Um, that's questionable. He is Af Af Afghani. Yeah, that's Afghan. how you say it, right? Afghan. 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 Like, oh my god, I gave you the fucking fattest face. I have the fattest face, to be fair. I don't think that's... No, you don't. You have like a... You just have a big face. I think that's the same thing, no? No. Alright, let me see how I can fix this. Oh you have like a good jawline. Yeah. And a deep voice. Like, you'd I be do. the perfect oh man. Oh my god, I think I would have killed it as like a butch lesbian. Or a man. Or a man. Yeah. Actually, I don't know about man. I'm, I, I'd be a really small man. I don't know if people are really looking for small men right now. Man, Why is your hair like that? What? Do you mean? <laughs> no, it's yeah, like I already could tell I'm not going on a second date with you. Look, I think we'd make such a lovely couple. Um, it's funny how we like we my met. Love letter to you, yeah. Because how did we meet? Just through online, like I was watching you on those like podcasts and. Yeah. They were like, I think Theo was trying to explain JK News. Yeah. And then you kind of like jumped in and helped him explain it. Yeah. I was like, oh shit, who's that talking about? So I looked you up. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, this is like a little like kind of, not I want to say cute, but like well, thanks. Asian girl. Yeah. So I was like, okay, cool. And then. Look at this Chinaman. <laughs> <laughs> so then I, I followed you. You yeah. followed me back because you, yeah. you knew who we were, right? Oh yeah, I knew who you guys were. Yeah. Absolutely. I've been watching you guys. And then. Like, uh for damn near like a decade at yeah. that point. Um, but we were following each other, we became cool and we started hanging out. We went on like a few like kickbacks, I don't know. Yeah, we definitely. Dinner, we Korean went barbecue. to uh, Korean barbecue a few times. And, oh yeah. my God, your hairline is just dripping into like the rest of your face. Um, but yeah, for the first, I'd say year of us being friends, or maybe even two years, we were like formal friends with each other. Yeah. And then recently, you came over to my house so we could record a YouTube video, mm -hmm. and we got very drunk. And by we, you did. I mean yeah. I got very drunk. Yeah. I'm a lightweight, and I don't drink. Sorry, I'm trying to figure out where your sideburns end. I don't think they really end anywhere. Um, they I'm, connect to the beard, kind of. Yeah. That's not bad feng shui. I wouldn't say that's good feng shui either. Connecting the beard to the hair? Like your sideburns... You know what? I take it back. It looks great. Um, what was I going with this? We were hanging out, but... Oh, yeah. And you I got didn't... so drunk, and now we can't stop insulting each other. Yeah. And I think now we're like I think that's really where our friends. friendship yeah, actually came from. Yeah. I didn't know, because this other girl used to like always DM me and like yeah. flirt with me. Yeah. Are you and talking about my sister right now? Yeah. I didn't know she was your sister, because we used to, like before we became friends... You didn't know? No, I didn't even know who we you were. We have the same face. No. Okay. Is that supposed to be? I'm not going to say anything mean. To who? Me or her? I, both of you guys. But um, she used to DM me all the time. or yeah. I think it was before DMs or anything. Just like message me on like, yeah. like leave comments and all that stuff. We yeah. would kind of do back and forth and I was just like a little bitch. I didn't do anything yeah. with it. Um, but you posted her one time. So this was after like we were friends for like a year. Yeah. And I was like, what the fuck? Like I used to flirt with your sister all the time. Yeah. So and was, it just never went anywhere. No. Nah. Yeah. That's how most of my interactions with women go. And why is that? Because um, I feel like you're a really charming guy. I can be, and then I, like, lose interest so quick. Yeah. And then, uh... Do you have commitment issues? No, not at all. You I think just get bored. I just, like, if I'm talking to a girl and they're just not, like, 100% what I want, I'm not going to, like, waste my time. Yeah. What is what... What's your ideal girl? Um... That's kind of hard to say. I don't know if I do is have... Is this, a, like, a, called the soul patch? 
tasting. Yeah. yeah. I call it a flavor saver. I don't know. You go first, and then maybe I okay. can like piggyback. So up. for me, I think generally speaking, my biggest thing with any guy is definitely how like how comfortable you can make me because I'm very socially awkward, and I'm somebody who will go out of their way to like be alone rather than have like an awkward situation. Yeah. So I really love being with people who just make me feel really comfortable right away. And so that's so, like sh- first sh- and sh- foremost. Look at, me, but... look at me, look at me, and smile. All right, thank you. Okay. So comfortability. Um, yeah, someone who can make me feel really comfortable. But I feel like that's super generic because who yeah. doesn't want to feel comfortable with someone? Yeah, definitely. But I don't know. I just like. Is that's... there like a, a first like, what's like a, you, how do you get attracted to them? Does it think, have to be looks okay. or do you have, usually it looks very crazy? usually like somebody who can, who looks like they're having fun. I feel like that's always attractive. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Someone's having a good time. Yeah. I, I'm not having a good time with this drawing. You, your lips look fucked. I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, yeah. But usually it's like if someone looks like they're having a good time, I have a good time just like by proxy. Yeah. I'm watching someone have a good time. I like to live vicariously through people. Um, and after that, looks wise, I would say I was always really attracted to short jacked men, like men who are short. Fi- yeah, because I'm only five three. I recently found out I'm five three. I thought I was five. Dude, the comments are gonna time. go crazy. Like you're gonna be like, I am the guys truly love you. a short king apologist. And what I mean by short, so I like short kings. I wouldn't say I like short guys in general because I feel like short kings are guys almost like um. Like your friend Tim, like he's a short king because he's like funny, he's personable, mm. he has a great personality. It's like you would never think he's a short guy unless you saw him in person. Yeah. Because he has such like an amazing personality about him. That's that's what I think a short king is. Not like this short, angry man, like this fucking angry gnome. Yeah. Um, But I was always very attracted to like short jacked guys who look like they don't have necks. Like, I don't know what it is. Like, if you have, like, a, like, if you're muscular to the point where it looks like you don't have a neck, it does something to me. I don't know what, but it does something. Um, and that was always kind of my type. Or nerdy boys. I really like nerd, like nerdy guys because I love when they get excited and tell me about things I have no idea about. Like, uh, my ex-boyfriend was really into watching people play Dungeons and Dragons mm-hmm. online. So I would sit and watch people play Dungeons and Dragons. We wouldn't play Dungeons and Dragons. We would watch other people play. Yeah. Um, and that was always sick. And then I learned how to play Magic the Gathering, which is like this card game. It's really nerdy card game for him because he didn't have any friends in LA who played. Uh, but yeah, I really love nerds. I really love short jacked men. I really like blondes now. And that is like, like does it have to be on a white guy or? Uh, not really. Like, if it's an Asian guy with like bleach, like, oh, I, like, I that, like yeah. the shaved head and like bleach. Blonde like from hair. Rush Hour One. Low key, yeah. When I was younger, Rush Hour One would have been like um, an absolute no go for me. But now that I'm older, I'm like, I kind of see it. I see the vision. God, you fucking look ugly. Like in real life or in your painting, both. In my painting. No, you look beautiful. I know we talk shit a lot, but. We talk a lot of shit and then I get... There's like subtle things like you, you give me a lot of compliments and then you yeah. immediately take it back, which I yeah. like. Because it's so I'm like, don't like make it awkward. Yeah, it's don't make it weird. Like, that's it. That's all I ask is like, you don't make it weird. Also, because I'm a girl and I used to work in comedy, I feel like a lot of people didn't want to make fun of me because they felt bad. And... I get why. I think it comes from a good place. But then I never really feel included in the group if mm. someone doesn't make fun of me. Because then I'm like, oh, okay. yeah, I don't... Like, I'm not a part of the club. Then, yeah. Like, I'm not really, like, a, a part of the gang because no one will, like, take... Yeah, if I don't like you, I'm not going to, like, make fun of you. I'll just talk shit. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Like, but behind your back. Yeah. Because I'm nice. But you talk shit to me. Yeah, but that's, like, also making fun of you. Like, when I say, like, oh, you're never going to have, like, a, a good life or fulfilling life, that's yeah. just me, like, teasing you. That's just you being my tarot card reader. <laughs> I want to go and get like my future told so bad or like tarot card spread. I'm afraid of that stuff. But I am afraid that they're going to take me for everything I have monetarily. So I just stick to my TikTok algorithm sending me stuff. Dude, I think because you have been getting all those like tarot card things. And then it's like, use this sound if like you want her to text you. Right. And then I'll be like. 
Do you use it? No, it's but you could like click on the comment if you like the comments like free, and then I'm like I'll do that, and then yeah. I'll immediately get a text. I'm like, wait, what the fuck? See, I don't know what it is, but every time I'm on TikTok and my algorithm gives me like some girl or some guy in their car giving me a tarot card reading, I know that I'm not doing well mentally, and I've been having these tarot card readings for the past like six months, so I know I should probably go back to therapy, but I'm having a blast. If I'm being completely honest. Yeah, keep doing what it. What color? Open your eyes. Like, really open them. They're, like, dark brown. Sick. Okay. Yours are just black and... Like, my soul. Yes. Give me big nostrils, because... You know what? I do have big nostrils. That's fine. Yeah, I, I don't know what I would say in terms of, like, going back to the what yeah. I look for in women. Um, just, like, someone who likes you back. Yeah, it's hard vibe. to find. Yeah. Uh, no, I think it's just about, like, if we hang out, how's the vibe? Like, yeah. are we actually having fun? Yeah. And it's like, obviously, I'm going to find you attractive if I want to hang out with you or, like, continue to see you. Yeah. But then from there, like, if it's boring or I have to force conversations or, like, really force it. Because yeah. sometimes just people are a little shy and whatever. I get that. But I've noticed, like, for me, it's all about, like, can we just sit there and, like, talk for hours and just have fun? Yeah. And that's all I really care about. And then from there, it's like, I'm not too into, like... Because I'm pretty shy myself, and I'm yeah. like, I don't want to do shit. Most of the time, I like being dragged out to things. Mm -hmm. um, I like someone that's like kind of ambitious, that kind of wants to explore, travel, yeah. do other things. And I'm like, it helps me bring me out of my shell. Which is wild. I feel like you're the friendliest, most outgoing person I've met. I don't know why people say that. Maybe because, I don't know, a lot of people do call me out. They're like, are you a Leo? And I'm like, yeah. Are you? Yeah. What do you think I am? Do you know anything about Zodiac sign? No. I don't know Only much. when I lie to women. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's fair. Uh, what do you think I am? Do you know all the zodiacs? No. Okay, let's list them. So, um, Leo, uh -huh. Aries, Sagittarius. What's what's before Those are the fire Leo? signs. What's before Leo? I don't know what the order is. I can tell you like the house, the the like the elements, and then so those are the fire ones. Um, so Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, water is Cancer, Pisces, are you Scorpio. Fire? Huh? You have to guess. And then there's air. Are you Aries? Is, uh, is that your guess? Yeah. No. Oh, okay. Uh, and then there's air, which is Aquarius, Gemini, miscellaneous. And then um, there's earth, which is Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. There's one missing. I don't know which one. But there. Oh, Libra. Libra is the other air one. You're not Libra, for sure. Why? Because I'm Cause, not like. Because you forgot even. about it. Oh, yeah, that's fair. Um, what do you think I am based off of your Scorpio? assumption of me? You think I'm a Scorpio? You think I'm a water sign? I have no idea. I am a Cancer. Okay. And I used to say that that makes so much sense. Because you're Cancer to be with? Truly, because... Why are you single? Why am I single? Yeah. Truly? I think it's because I'm low-key insane. Uh -huh. And I just hide it really well. Yeah. I, I I'm not even fucking kidding. Like, I... Because when I'm we were talking not, the other day, like, you were like, you just want a guy that can, like, be passionate about you and you'll take care of everything. Yeah. I'm like, is that hard to find? Apparently it is. Apparently it is. Um, oh, I just, God, dude, this, <laughs> this dude, sucks looks so like, bad. I don't know how to do your nose. I think it's going to look great. And then you have art to hang up on your wall in your apartment. Oh, fuck. I don't know if I want to put this up. I wouldn't put mine up <laughs> if I were you. Yeah. Right, I'm just gonna start working on your body because. Yeah, yeah. Oh no. Um, um. I think this like vaguely looks like you, but it all. Do you remember that movie Ben Affleck was in? It was about like the planes. The planes. This is such a bad description because I also didn't watch the movie. But there's a movie with Ben Affleck where he uh, has like. The mustache beard combo and you kind of look like him in that like based off my painting like this could look like an afghan man you but this also oh. that, that's the one that's the one mike thank you i was struggling um so i could look like him and, and you don't look like him this looks like it could be him if i was drawing him strictly from memory yeah you look like i'm Go on. I wouldn't know how to describe this. Yeah. 
It was bad. Like yeah, you, it's just you went, bad. You went through a lot. Like this is like you were floating in a river, like yeah. dead for weeks. Yeah. And they pull your body out. This is probably what you look like. Oh, why did I do that? Oh no. So this is like my like found. Yeah. Painting. Like we found her in the river. She's like bloated. Yeah. Her body's kind of like discolored. Yeah, but it's not far off from like what she used to look like anyway, so it's fine. Yeah. Yeah. But also like this watercolor is like dripping, so like now you have yeah. boogers. Yeah. And I don't know how to fix it. And I, for some reason, I gave your nostrils. I made your nostrils black, so now you just like. You gave me a black nose. Well, because your nostrils, like the the holes in your nose. Okay, sick, sick. Well, I want it to be accurate. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't have nostrils. I can't truly. I can't see them from here, and that says a lot because I'm shorter than you. So maybe you don't have nostrils. All right. Well. Um. I wish you didn't what? draw each other. <laughs> this yeah. is pretty bad, though. This is gonna be great. I just hope you're not offended. I. Don't think anything you draw of me is going to offend me more than the things that you've sent me over text. Mm. To be completely fair. Do you remember one of them? Because there was some good ones. There were some good ones. I don't remember what off the top of my head. I feel like you've called me a hobbit before. I call you short all the time. Yeah, because like to be fair, oh, why does that look like that? I don't know. I just feel very at home with you. Because you are so blatantly mean to me, mm -hmm. I just feel like this makes sense. Yeah, I sent I sent I a girl. Here. I sent a girl the other day a TikTok that's like, yeah. I think it was like she's a ten, but she talk constantly talks shit to you, and yeah. that makes her like an eleven. Yeah, and then she immediately started talking shit to me, and I was like, yeah. you trying to make me come? Mm -hmm. You don't talk about that. What coming? Yeah, I don't think you're like a sexual being. You don't think I have sex? I, in my head, you don't. Like I'm, I'm sure you. You do, did like <laughs> once once upon a time but like i don't think of that with you Low what the hell we had this whole facetime conversation about it before not yeah. about us but like yeah you were showing me some fucking oh my god so i am in the process of like moving and i forget where i put some things and so now, sometimes I'm like, I'm petrified that the day I move, I'm going to forget, like, all of my stuff in, like, my, my drawer. Because, like, you know, like, everyone has, like, their bedside drawer. And sometimes, like, as a woman, as a single woman, like, you have some, some stuff, you know? Um, and I'm petrified that I'm going to leave that there. And then, like, the movers or something are going to find it. I'm, like, truly, like, I don't think what I would be able... Why do you look like this? I don't want to see. <laughs> I thought the water watercolors would like um more water. like more soften water. soften it up and it's not. Nothing is softening. I at all. I honestly truly believe that however bad you think yours is, mine is gonna like shock you. Really? It's worse. Okay. Cause I don't know who this man You look like a drag queen. Say something nice about me. You just about me right now. And don't think too hard, because it's going to make me feel bad. You, you but, showed up today. No, come on. Thank you. Something serious. Uh, something serious? Um, You are very funny. Thank you. I think you are much funnier than I ever would have given you credit for originally. Is that based off, you don't think my comedy is funny online? Uh, not just that. I feel like I don't find many people funny anymore uh -huh. and i think that's just because when i used to work in comedy i think i got fatigued comedically and so now i don't find many things funny and mm -hmm. i feel like when i giggle or i laugh it's more so a reaction to fill up space than it is that i found something actually funny yeah it's like a nervous tick for me that makes sense i feel like i have a hard time making people laugh in person but like they'll look at my stuff or like they'll look at your face and they're like that's hilarious yeah. they'll see my content and they'll they're like oh shit like you, you like make people laugh i don't know and I'm, they're like yeah. like it but then in person when i tell them like oh i'm trying to do comedy they're like what why they're like what? why would you do that I'm like, all right well thanks yeah. but i think with you like we we get along so well that it's just mm -hmm. it's so much easier I, I don't know whether to draw your glasses or not. I don't even think tr you should try at this yeah. point. I don't, I don't even want to give you ears, if I'm being completely honest. I yeah. just want to give you, like, a thick neck. <sighs> you do have a thick neck for a guy. Really? Yeah. 
I think it's really weird if I start paying too much attention to people's like bodily anatomy because then I start finding like weird things about them. I'm like, why is your neck like that? It's not even that weird though. It's not that weird, but like, it's like when you see, to me, I get the same feeling when I see a word for too long. Like if I look at cow on mm. a piece of paper for too long, it looks weird to me. That's what I do with people. And then I get weirded, or I don't get weirded out, but they get weirded out because I'm looking at them for way too damn long. Look at me, look at Just that mole. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so sorry. You kind of look like a monkey. I'm not even kidding. Dude, I feel in, bad. In this, not like... I'm going to start working on the background because I don't think I'm a... Yeah. Mine's going to get any better. Yeah. Oh, my God. You know what? You think you're done? I I don't think I'm done. Um, What about you? I think I'm done. I, you think you're done? Yeah. You think this is like the best? Okay, yeah. give me like another like minute real quick. I'm going to just like add a few other things. <sighs> I'm trying to think like... <sighs> Man. I feel like this is going to come out and it's going to be like, oh, I didn't do terribly. And then I'm going to look at yours and be like, what the fuck is that? Can you look at me real quick? <laughs> it's actually pretty good, yeah. It's cute. This is like the most fucked up date. Smile. Cute. Do you put my teeth in there? Oh my god, dude, no. that's like the whole thing. You're beautiful veneers. I know. I like spent so, not even so much money on them, but mm -hmm. dude, during the pandemic, I was so sad that like I had to wear a mask still when I yeah. got these. Because when did you get them done? You're During like, the pandemic. During the pandemic. Yeah, they like opened up in January to like uh -huh. flights. Yeah. So I immediately booked one and then they canceled like everything again like the really? month after. Yeah. But I was like, I got in quick and got Did you get out. one of those like clear like visors that people start wearing instead of masks? No, because so I feel like that would have been too douchey. Everyone yeah. kept sending me those to like get. Yeah. But I was like, oh, that might be too, doing too much. Your teeth are really nice. I've yeah. seen some bad veneers. No, I like, I researched them for a long ass time before I got them. And... Yeah, a lot of people were like, some people could tell, they're like, dude, you have really nice teeth, like veneers. Mm -hmm. uh, and I'm like, yeah, obviously, I, like, I'm, I'm super yeah. open about it. But some people, you could just be like, well, what the fuck is wrong with your teeth? Because some people, they either get it like way too white, yeah. or sometimes it almost leans on being blue. Like I've seen yeah. somebody who looks kind of blue. Like my teeth are pretty white. They're I mean, good. I just ate food, but yeah. um, these are like four shades down from the whitest white. Yeah. And this was a big difference from the, the next shade up. Mm -hmm. And then... Some people get them too straight, too big. But the place I went to in Turkey was mm -hmm. like, they did such a good job. Yeah. And they'll kind of like, they'll let you do whatever you want, but they kind of give you recommendations on what yeah. looks natural. And then when I got that, they were like, hey, everyone, like nobody listens to us. Yeah. They they're, they they come in, they're like, they want it straight. They want it super wide. They want all this. But yeah, like, it doesn't, it doesn't look, look realistic yeah. anymore. Like I had like them make my two front teeth a little bit bigger than the side teeth. Give me canines. Mm -hmm. Canines? Yeah. Can yeah. Canines. Yeah. Yeah. Vampire teeth? Yeah. 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 yeah sick. I kind of wish I got those a little bit longer, but I could just get them redone eventually. Do you have a photo of yourself when they, like, um... Yeah. They filed it all down. Yeah, yeah. You want to see? Yeah. While you finish up? Absolutely. Do you look crazy in them? Has... Have any of your veneers ever fallen out? <laughs> I saw a video of a girl. She was making a TikTok. In mid-TikTok, her uh, front veneer falls out. Oh, my God. I've seen that, yeah. That, I don't know. Like, she's just talking. It's not like she was eating anything. I don't know how it falls out because I don't think that's like supposed to happen. Mm -hmm. Like to take mine out, you would have to shave them down. Yeah. Unless like the glue just fails or something. Yeah. Oh my god. Why do you look like this? I'm so sorry. You ready? Yeah. Oh, ready. I never want to see that photo ever again. You want to see the video? That all that white stuff on the side, I'll send it to you guys so you can like add it in. That's my teeth. Like this, like. This. Do you have to redo your veneers like every? Yeah, like years? every ten to fifteen years. Because that's that's what it's like with boob jobs too. Mm. Uh, my aunt was telling me that she has to go get hers redone once every like decade, and she didn't know that she was supposed to like get them redone. She thought you just like get a pair of tits. And then, so like, what happens to them? So she just like goes and you need to get it taken out. And I think she was one of the people who got sick from her oh, sh for, from her implants. And so she just like had, took them out completely. Are they just like floppy now? I don't think they're flop. I don't know. I I've seen, seen people take out their boobs. Yeah. The boobs. And then they go back to like being small and they look nice. Yeah. But I'm like, I would think that would just be like hella extra skin. 
I think that only really happens if you have like gi the ginormous like mm. kids. I don't know. Okay, are you ready to reveal? <laughs> All right, ready? Okay, yeah. You wanna go first or at the same time? Um, let, let's you know what? Time. Yeah, let's do same time, then we'll, yeah, let's just go from there. Okay, right, one, two, three. Oh my oh, god. I... <laughs> Yours is terrible. Dude. The nose is a little rough. I'm like, it's not terrible. This is horrible. <laughs> this is scary. Why are my eyes yellow? <laughs> I don't know. I thought we said we were doing yellow. It's not. It's the color you told me to pick. That's not that color. It's that color. I swear to God. Look, 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 look. Look, it's, it's this color. All right. Well, it's that color. Oh, I was yeah, feeling I really think, bad about mine. I think you did really good in comparison. I would like to say... It's really hard with watercolors. Like, I, I'm not this bad of an artist, but... So sorry to this man. Um, like, I think at the very least, if I went missing and you had to show someone like one picture of me that you created yourself, yeah. I think they could probably kind of find me. Based on this, they would not be able no, to find you. On you this. don't have like the typical Asian eyes, but... What does that mean? I should have made your eyes more Asian in this. What does that mean? Like, or like, uh, you still have like a slit, or like, yeah, not kind of. I don't know. Your eyes are pretty bold, bold, round. I don't want to sound racist, but say it. Round. I just said it. Okay. But yeah, so that's not racist. But I feel like I should have made them the more like is, well, cat like eyes. That. Yeah. Play on words. Um, don't do that. The the mole though is pretty nice. The what? The mole. The mole is cute. Your eyes are surprisingly good. You. I will give you your eyes. I like you my look eyelashes. Like you got yeah. You gave me good eyelashes. You're like demented in mine. Know. Yeah, I'm so sorry. I made you look like a monkey, low key. Is my beard that scraggly? Like, <laughs> you know what? I was trying to add dimension to it. Yeah. Um. I started with your hair, and that's yeah. why I fucked up. Yeah. 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 I don't. I should give you a bigger forehead. I think Honestly, that I, I I think you were very um, kind to me with the forehead, yeah. being that small. Uh, I think the face could have been squarer, in my opinion. Yeah. But it's nice. I think you made me look better than I actually look, uh -huh. and I made someone else. I don't think this is you. No, but I think in a lineup, if they were like, who's who? Yeah. They'd be like, okay, that's okay. me, obviously. Okay, so, yeah. like, so you, you did a good job of like... Just hold this right here. Yeah. Slay. That's you. That's ba that's basically you. And then this is weird. And yeah. You see your nostrils? Yeah. They're like Why? leaky. You know, I think this could have been so good up until the the nose. Cause like I, I'll even take the green neck. I don't know what's happening with the neck. But oh, I'll it's because because it, you know like yellow and blue kind of mixed together. And yeah. Then it makes you green. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's like you know sometimes the girls they put on makeup on just their face and they don't blend it. Yeah. Yeah, that's what you did. It's pretty obvious. Not you. I'm just saying when women do it. Okay. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I am woman. No, you. you yeah. No, you, no, you look I, great. I you look great. Okay. Everything I, I say about you and your looks is a lie. Mm-hmm. Everything I say about you and your looks I know is uh, absolutely true. All but right. Yeah, well. Thank you for coming. Yeah. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for the painting. Um, I'll make sure to hang up somewhere in my house. No, and, please uh, don't. I'll put it right next to the uh, the toys. Just a portrait of me right next to them, and the movers can find it when they they find it. Nice. So, yeah. uh, thanks for coming. Where are we going on a second date? Um, you know what? Uh, I am pretty busy since it's the new year. Mm -hmm. Um, I can um, you text you. You're busy. Yeah, I I'm so busy. Doing what? Um, I started watching Tudors mm. on Amazon Prime. Um, I can come I, over. No, yeah, we have to save money. I think it. I think it's fine. I like watching uh, shows about beheading. So oh yeah, I'm with it. Alone. Yeah. Oh, alone. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I, um, I, I. So you don't need to talk anymore. I I think we could be like pen pals. Like I could send you like a flat Stanley in the mail. Fat Stanley. Flat oh, Stanley. Okay. Yeah. Um, I was gonna say because like I'm fat. Yours would definitely be yeah, a little yeah. bigger than the standardized sized one, but. Yeah. Um, Based on this painting, I wouldn't go out with you. I think again. it's close enough. Yeah. Close enough. All right. Well. Yeah. Bye, guys.